your girl Rose Juice here today and today we're gonna do a top five type of thing but what we're gonna do is I'm gonna put this right over here but what we're gonna do is I'm gonna tell you guys it's Valentine's Day and a couple of like a couple of people well a lot of people sometimes don't know what to do on Valentine's Day it's really hard to pick stuff for your partner or whoever you have Valentine's Day because it doesn't have to be like a couple thing but I'm gonna tell you a couple of things that you can do for Valentine's that will be time con not new time consuming you like think right away and you welcome for giving these ideas so the first one basically is you can book a cooking class for your partner and you you know it's a little good thing you know to do like go to cooking class eat what you cook you know learn how to cook together as one unit and shit so that's a very good idea to do is just go to a cooking class they're not really that expensive to be honest with you or if you want to you can just cook at your house and you know go to Food Network and or YouTube and you know do what you want make your little home cooking class at home type of thing um the second one is going on a fancy dinner date these are for the people who really wants to go out and don't want to be staying in um I am not one of those people I love food but I like staying in but going to a fashion restaurant you know getting dressed up getting dolled up and makeup and shit you know that's one way to go for it um there's a lot of restaurants in new york city that you can actually go to there's nobi there is carmine there is red lobster is not really that fancy but you know red lobster if you like seafood go ahead um there's applebee's if you want to budget um where else oh there's what you call it hot rock cafe downtown it's really freaking good down there like i freaking love the food there you know you can do those fancy th stuff and the third one is basically going to a fancy hotel because i know some of you little nasties think valentine's is just <laughs> you know that little nasty shit but you know you can do that too you know there's a lot of cheap ex little cheap hotels in downtown or anywhere you at you know to have a little fancy you know night out with your whoever you, you know dating now if you're not dating you can just go to you know fancy hotel and just chill and you know hang out talk watch movies you know with your friends that you actually love for your round times okay the next one is going to a dance class I do love doing this one because this one I love dance dance I used to do dance all the freaking time I used to do it in my after school program and I used to do dance performances in my middle school elementary school and high school I was very into the arts in my school years but um doing dance classes can help you know help your partner find their groove and shit bond you know do a routine a little spicy things up you know do some salsa you know some people don't know how to do salsa so salsa dancing on Valentine's Day spicy make that shit spicy as hell um the other one you can do a little picnic now Valentine's Day is in February and it's freaking cold ain't nobody got time to be going picnics outside you can do a picnic in your house literally put a little blanket in your living room put a little lights and shit decorated and get the little picnic basket and go on the floor and you got a picnic inside see voila you safe you warm and you don't gotta leave your house so probably gonna do that one because I really don't like leaving my house or you can do this one you can cook and Netflix and chill I know everybody's gonna be like yo I'm going Netflix and chill you can do that too but sometimes Netflix and chill has a little bit of a meaning with you little nasty people nasty ass people mm -hmm. talk about y'all mm -hmm. but yeah I think those are the top 
ones I can think of. Oh, but for Valentine's, you ideas for gifts. You can give your partner flowers, chocolate. Some people don't like flowers. I personally don't because they die, and I want flowers to be preserved for a forever thing. So I like the fake flowers instead. But flowers chocolate chocolate is a must you better get that good kind of chocolate because if you get that one dollar chocolate we ain't talking mm. um what else that's about it for valentine oh teddy bears i love teddy bears i love the rose ones like if you see the rose teddy bears love those um but yeah, as long as it's a sentimental value thing that you give your partner, I think it'll be perfectly fine. Um, but just know your partner. That's about it. And these are the only things that I can tell you guys about Valentine's Day. And there will be a Valentine's makeup look and hairstyle coming very soon. Probably this Tuesday. You should know. Check it out because there will be a little special surprise coming that day. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, and like. And I'll see you lovebirds on Tuesday. Deuces.